talking. <laughs> Every Christmas tree that has a star is a star on a plant, Ryan. To get some last minute items before Christmas. Can I use this in my room? Absolutely. Friends got home from taking the ACTs. Oh, yeah. Wouldn't be Christmas without it. Exactly. Let's fire it up. Yeah. Until. Ow! Ow! <laughs> I'll be crying to beat anyone in our whole family in a fight. Aww. Like, be not to be rude. <laughs> like, Brennan, be Brennan did tackle or pin him one time with Twice. his hands behind his Two back. Times. Yeah. yeah. Hands. Both he, hands he, behind he his back. He showed up, tripped me, and then just went like this. And then just sat on me. We so many baby Christmas trees in our house. I know. I mean, I guess we just had three, but. Yeah, but that's a lot. Wait, let me show you what I did. Oh, did you decorate it? Okay, that's a joke with mistletoe. I, I'm sorry, look at that. Do we need better mistletoe? It's like... We've had it for a while. It's hard to find. <gasps> I decorated my tree. Katie, it's so cute. Thanks. But the star wouldn't stand on top of it because the top's kind of like hunky. Okay. So I put the star on my succulent. Oh my gosh, that's cute. That's and I adorable. just moved it from my desk over here so it was... More nose. More, um, yeah, so festive. Isn't it cute? It's no, adorable. Well, no. we can make, we can do a different topper. <gasps> Why don't you get a little angel? Oh, no, you want something red or green. Yeah. What the heck? Isn't that cute? No. <laughs> it's adorable. On a plant. Yeah. It's making That's everything every, Christmassy, dark. Every Christmas tree that has a star is a star on a plant, Ryan. Uh, yeah, good well, point. Yeah, but good that's point. just dumb. Oh. I don't see any Christmas decorations in your room. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm not a girl. I would beat them up again. I, I think you might, again. I would think you might need to. Them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, All right, you guys, so our day is um, fairly typical. That's kind of what happens <laughs> all the time. Okay, excellent. We have more Christmas. Actually, this is the last of the Christmas decorations left to put up for inside. And then we are going to move to the outside where we have garland and wreaths and all that stuff. There's our wall again. Wait. And our new TV. Well, the TV is not new. The new rack Can holding the TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you what? Can I use this in my room? Absolutely. Except for I think, I think it might go on this guy no. or that guy. No. It goes in my room. I mean, you can try it. Yeah, that'd be cute. Let's move. Okay, go yeah, ahead. I think I don't think that was in time. Yeah, that's awesome. Watch this. I'm a Christmas decorating geek. Yes, you are. You know what's a Christmas miracle? What? I was just digging in our pantry and I found an unopened bag of Jack Link's beef jerky. Oh, uh, that is a Christmas miracle. <gasps> Katie, that's so cute. Yeah, it's it's not even. It's about to fall off. How do I like make it stay though? Yeah, you did. There you go. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> yep, there you have it. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. You just did that like lickety split. Yeah, I mean, I'm just. You're very good at decorating and at cooking. You're very good at cooking too. Ryan learned how to make omelets yesterday. <laughs> and he rocked yeah. the omelet. Ryan the omelet. Ryan the omelet. Oh, yeah. I kind of cooked those omelets or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I mean, between you don't that. Do anything, but, uh, between that and the ribeyes you made for Dad's birthday. Mom, whoa, you are the man. What Thomas would you stuff. say is your favorite Christmas decoration? Wow, that's a really good question. Could this go in the mansion downstairs? Sure. Or no? Is that what make, make it too, like... Well, there's a lot... I don't want it to be too many words. Are there a lot of words already? Down? Oh, maybe not. I don't think there's any words. That'd be cute. Yeah, take it down and see. I was thinking we would put <laughs> the whole... Santa Clauses on the mantle, um, but... So, my brothers never clean up the kitchen. Um, <laughs> they always make things and then don't clean them up. Mm -hmm. Which stresses me out because I like to keep the kitchen nice and clean. Yes. Okay, so these are the Santa Clauses. Okay. And we have so many of them. Okay. These are only three of them. I don't. <gasps> be don't careful. Worry. He's, I got, I got he, he's yeah. Been broken he has been times. broken a few times. Um, he's cute though. Uh huh. So these are only three of them, but there's more. Uh huh. Do you know what I, I don't know. We have to keep unpacking. Okay. Well, this guy matches very well with our upstairs silver decor blue sure. white theme. Okay. These guys are more of the red green downstairs theme. Downstairs theme. So, I feel like he wouldn't look as good um, downstairs on the mantle okay. as he would up here. All so, right. we're going to wait until we find the other Santa Clauses. 
I mean, we can still put these down there. But Thank you, Ryan, for cleaning so up. Noise. Here's another Santa Claus, but he... <laughs> he's in the bathroom. He's a soap dispenser. <laughs> yeah. But, like, I feel like, I feel like this could okay. go, like, like, somewhere... Over on the new shelves? Well, yeah. I'll leave it up to you. Katie, like. Katie and Ryan are our decorating well, fiends. Well, I think that the globe... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The snow globe. We'll check back in and see how Kate and Ryan do. Bye. I am up and out and headed to the mall to get some last minute items before Christmas. I've pretty much gotten down the kids' wish list as much as I can. <laughs> but I have a few last minute items to get because now it's too late to order them to ship to home. So I'm going to go into the mall and see if they have them here. So hang okay, on. you guys, I did much more shopping than I thought I was going to, which is actually good. Uh, I had a lot on my list. Anyway, so now I get to come home and take care of my Fetch app. So that means I get to take the receipts from the things that I purchase and upload them into my app. You guys have heard me talk about Fetch before and so many of you out there have told me that you love Fetch and that you're already using it. If you don't know what it is and you haven't used it yet, jump on board. I don't know why you're not doing it yet. Fetch is an app that allows you to save and, um, and earn points every time you shop. And I mean, you're shopping anyway. Why not earn points and earn rewards for shopping? You save every time you purchase one of Fetch's thousands of participating products. It's very easy. All you need to do is you just scan your receipt and you can scan earn points, and then spend your rewards all from your um, mobile device within a matter of minutes. It's super simple. The process only takes a few minutes and it doesn't matter where you made your purchase or what items you purchased. You don't have to use a coupon or anything like that. Just by scanning your receipt, it, it knows what you purchased and it calculates it all together and then gives you the points for it. So it's, it couldn't be easier. So watch this, this is what I do. I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture of my receipt. Back up, back up, back up, take a picture and then submit. Next thing you know, it's thinking, it's thinking, and it gives me my points right away. Look at that. So I just earned points just by doing shopping that I would normally have been doing anyway. It's so simple. And not only that, okay, so when you upload all your receipts and you get your points, your points get uh, accumulated and you can earn gift cards. So right now, for example, I'm saving up for a Dunkin' Donuts gift card because Mike loves Dunkin' Donuts coffee and it's something I'd like to get him for. It's a little bit more expensive than the rest, so by having a gift card, it makes it a lot easier. But anyway, so you save up your points, and you can get gift cards from Amazon, from Dunkin' Donuts, from Ulta, from Target, Visa. There's all kinds of different gift cards that you can save up for, and magazine subscriptions. So tons of different kinds of rewards. So this is the deal. If you download Fetch, when you upload your first receipt and put in the Donnelly's as your promo code, you get it a bonus 4,000 points, which is like over half of what I have now. So it's a, that's a lot of points. So go ahead and click the link in the description below if that's something you think you'd be interested in. Also, I'll tell you that now that, that Fetch has the ability to give points for um, all restaurant purchases and retail. So whether you're dining in, carrying out, I know everybody's state has something different going on right now. So if you're lucky enough to dine in, but if you get to, die, uh, to carry out as well, you can still scan your receipt and get your points for Fetch. I have to say that I receive um, really the most rewards from my grocery shopping because I think that's the most shopping I do. And I do a lot of it online, so I do use my e-receipts. Um, but in a, like Instacart, for example, um, and it just fetch when you click the little E, it scans all my emails to see if I purchased anything from Amazon, to see what, what my Instacart receipt is, and it just automatically uploads it like that. So really, if you just scanned your grocery receipts and that was it, you'd earn tons of rewards. But at this point, I like to scan every receipt that I have. So again, check out the link in the description below. Use code the Donnelly's to receive your free 4,000 points. All you need to do is download, sign up, scan, and that's it. All right, so I'm gonna go downstairs right now and see Katie, because I think she's downstairs wrapping some Christmas gifts. So. Greasy black peel. Katie is watching the Grinch with the fire on and the Christmas tree and she's doing all of her Christmas wrapping. For Katie, Christmas is like an out of body experience. Right? You're like the most, you love Christmas. Yes. I'm the favorite Christmas what? person. You are the favorite Christmas. I mean, Christmas is your favorite of all things. Christmas. I'm I'm the one that likes Christmas the most in this house. Like the Christmas traditions and that kind of thing. No, no. <laughs> the birth of Jesus Christ, all that. Uh, Same. Still, still. More than us? Yeah. I don't know about that part, but certainly the. Yeah. No, for sure. 
I would say I'm second. I'm second to you when it comes to like Christmas decorating and Christmas wrapping and Christmas getting into. Would you say that? Yes. So Katie has already wrapped two presents. This is her third. Who's that for? Yeah. Oh, that's my present? Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Okay, Katie goes above and beyond too when it comes to wrapping. This is Brennan's present. Except we don't have any wrapping paper. I know. That's Ryan's present. Look how beautiful that is. That is my present. Just Ugh. gorgeous. Katie, she's always the first one with her presents under the tree. Always. I know. Because I'm just like that. I know. She always has all of her shopping done. She's very prepared. Very, very, um, very Christmas prepared. Yes. And she did all of this all by herself. She did all of this decoration. Kate, we have you to thank for Christmas this year. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you. Christmas would not happen without me. Like, I don't know why. Christmas, it's... but it wouldn't be... Yes. Yeah. Well, we're finishing up. We still have, like, a bunch of muck and stuff over there we need to, like, put away. We took a lot of stuff down from upstairs when we did the new wall. And then a lot of Christmas, like, we, these are the boxes left over from Christmas decorations I need to put away. So it's all clean and pretty down here. Look. Look at the sale. It's actually Max. 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 Bro, All right, I have to go eat my lunch. Man. He said Sam. Uh, he he looks so like bald. Sam. You All right, turn it back up. Should, I'm gonna... I, should I wrap Kayla's present right now? Oh, yes. That's a good idea. Put oh, it under the know. tree. It has to be in a... uh, well, let's ask Dad. He might know where the Christmas wrap is. Dad! Ah! He's ready. Ready to say... Friends go home from taking the ACTs. Oh, ACTs. ACTs. That's a standardized <laughs> college <laughs> test. Not he really. does. Yeah, I sweat. Tell him what happened now. My calculator died. Oh no! Yeah. That was not good. Oh man, just can't get, can't get a break. Can't get a break. You can take the ACTs as many times as you want, right? You yeah, but it, he's huh? applied for college already, so it's the last opportunity huh? to send grades. So what'd you end up doing? Uh, just had to do some like. Not mental math, but... Some you know, insane, like, yeah. pencil paper yeah, stuff. Write it down. Oh, Brennan, so, like, energy, yes, like, yes. multiplication, like, division and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Brennan, that makes me sad for you. I'm sorry. It's okay. I think I'm all right. I bet your head is like about to explode. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm making you two grilled cheese sandwiches and some chicken noodle soup. What do you think about that? Why that does sounds he do that? fantastic. Why does he get stuck? Why does he get Love stuck? You. Because he just took a big fat test. I just read three presents. <laughs> Everybody wants something. Everybody wants something. Hey, uh, the girls, uh, Katie and um, her pole vault folks and gymnastics folks or ex-gymnastics folks are out um, pole vaulting. It's a beautiful day in Maryland. Mm -hmm. Ryan and I are going to get it done. <laughs> we got a little problem out here and that is this <laughs> is a lot of leaves and stuff that Vaughn is making a sad statement. So yeah, Ryan and I are gonna work on it. All right, so are we? Look, Bob did a pretty nice job here. Honestly, yeah. But uh, I wish we had the leaf blower still. We do have a leaf blower. Well, yeah, but I kind of broke it. Here we go. Yeah. Kind of broke it. Did you see it? I, you know, the thing when you pull to get it started, it wasn't starting. I pulled it really hard. Cause Dad, it's a really cheap leaf blower. We had it for like seven years, Dad. We had it for so long. It's it's such a cheap leaf blower. Uh -huh. All right, let's get to work. All right. Okay, Ryan, what happened here? Okay, well, so if you ever started a leaf blower, you know there's this thing, and it's usually connected inside the leaf blower, and you pump gas into it, and then you go like this, and the engine starts. Uh huh. Well, one day I was doing it, and it like works for a little bit, then shut off, and works for a little bit, then shut off. Not acting like a normal leaf blower. And then I kept pulling it, and I was like, huh, oh, and then I thought it was just because I wasn't pulling it hard enough, so uh, I just, ah, and then it. You yanked it right out of it. And I yanked it right out, and then I was like so surprised because I didn't know that could happen. Huh? And. It did. Yeah. Now we're going old school. Now we're going old school. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, here we go. I'll see it. <laughs> Okay, Ryan and I finished up. I actually didn't do too bad here. The lawn looking a little bit better. Growth that we had all, all during the summer is now cut and ready for the springtime. 
Okay, one of the things that Ryan and I do every year, it's just kind yeah. of the thing we do. What's, yeah. the, what's the thing that we do? Are you talking about the lights? Oh, you're talking about the lights. I am. Okay, so we hang lights on our dock and it looks amazing. And I think, by the way, that's talking we're going to do that right now. I think, uh, I think it is. I don't Let's think we go. have a choice. So yeah, we got to measure because I think we're all, the, all the ones we can't find. Mm, from last bad. year. So we got to measure yeah. and then we got to go get them and then we got to go pull yeah. them out. Last year, I remember it was like freezing cold. It was around this time or mm -hmm. maybe even earlier. It's freezing cold nighttime and we did it. And um, yeah, so I think it's much better to do it daytime when it's not freezing cold. Agreed. Agreed. Like, yeah. uh, like on a day like today. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm going to watch football and do homework. Yeah, it's kind of a nice thing we do, huh? Yeah. Should we do homework first and then uh, do the lights because it'll be dark? Sure. Hmm. I, I don't know. We can, I mean, we still got a lot of the daylight. Should we show everybody? Yeah. So this is the pier, and Ryan and I are gonna put. Oh, look! I think we still have the um, extension cord out there from. Um, yeah, from, from the Yes. Okay, so uh, we run an extension cord out, and then we have the lights kind of hang and dangle along the thing. You'll see it if you if you've seen uh if you've been watching our videos for a while, then you already know. Yeah. Looks like. Should look nice though, huh? Yes, very. Wouldn't be Christmas without. Exactly. Let's fire it up. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.